when an individual is diagnosed with a serious illness such as cancer, the most important decision is picking your doctor. And that's the hardest thing to do because the doctor that looks the most attractive or is the youngest or the oldest or the shortest or is ethnically appropriate may not be the best doctor for you. You know, you can fire your doctor actually, ever so respectfully. If, if you got an auto mechanic and they didn't do a good job at fixing your car, you think you'd go back to them? It is the same thing with a physician. If you're not satisfied with the level of care that you're getting for your serious illness like a cancer, you need to find a better doctor. I empower you to find a better doctor. So what, what's a good doctor? A doctor, first of all, is someone that's adequately trained. And if an ovarian cancer, that's a gynecologic oncologist. There aren't very many, but there are sufficient numbers for you to go see a gynecologic oncologist, and I empower you to do that. Why? Because they have different training and experience. Let me give you an example. So medical oncologists may only treat a few ovarian cancer patients in a lifetime, or maybe even a year, when a gynecologic oncologist might treat 10 in a day. So there is knowledge and experience that comes in repetition, and you want that in your life because it will help you live longer and better.